jizz both that day. video of the day because I'm literally bored. Yes. I will make some makeup tutorials later someday. Someday. Maybe they will be complete once I figure out how to put on my makeup in time. Yeah, I have no makeup today. I can make another one, but I don't, I'm not even dressed for the occasion. It's just got a stupid sweatshirt of campus, which is my favorite sweatshirt. My mommy gave it to me and I love it. Okay, but back to the video. Virgin Day, Abby, it's, it's Epica Cupivira, and if you've seen, I am a virgin. I've talked about that a lot. Why do I talk about this a lot? Because I'm proud and sick of it at the same time. I'm going to tell you why. And I'm going to talk about virginity. Yay, girl guy code. <laughs> I just saw that on TV. It's so funny. <laughs> it was like, um... Uh, and then talk about what we all want to do, God code, and then, and then we're like, when you put your P in a V, that's a new pick of a G. <laughs> I was like, I couldn't stop laughing, so I was like, so I gotta get a P in my V to become a W. Or a G for a gal. <laughs> okay, so, virginity. Let's talk about virginity. What to talk about virginity? Virginity is something you've got when you haven't did, done, or fucked a man. How do you have the, how do you have this? Well, you're born with it. Yeah. Well, um, I'm going to talk about virginity laws here in Mexico. In the USA. What the hell is wrong with my bangs? Um, I won't stop until I, there. <laughs> In um there. in Mexico, it is normal for a girl to lose her virginity between the ages of fourteen. Okay, no, I'm just I'm just trying to be a pet. Actually, they lose it when they're like fucking twelve or thirteen to eighteen, seventeen. Yeah. And you know what fucking age I am? I'm 19 and I'm a virgin and I'm proud and sick of it at the same time. I will say why later. But, um, here and in USA, I think it's about the same age. Now, let's talk about this. I really don't know why people say it's that wrong to lose it that young. Because, look. So, yeah. Before. Let's go before the Mozart time. You married at, I don't know, say 15, 14 years old. There was a time back in time, I don't know if it was Mozart's time. But before, when um you married at that age, so it was logical. You had your stupid, um, your stupid honeymoon. So it had to lose your virginity, right? It's like the day your, your wedding sex, or how do you call that? I don't know. So that's what they did before and then came an idea that you should wait and get married um I don't know about your 20 something or 17 something like that and lose your virginity until your marriage well that's what um 
the church says. So that when I am and when I think that of the fact that I am a virgin, I'm happy about that because I'm like, okay, yeah, I'm following church. But then I realize I live in the year 2013. Yay, we did not die in 2012. Anyway, I live in the year 2013, and it's kind of abnormal for a girl to be a virgin at my age. Why is this abnormal? Because then it's like you're weird. I'm not weird. I don't think I'm weird. I think I've got everything in order down there. But the problem is, this is why I haven't had sex. I am one of those stupid little, but actually not stupid. If you think like me, you're not stupid. Yeah, but stupid for the stupid people who lose it when they're about 13. If you, um, this is what I think. I'm going to say it like this. I have the idea, I, yes, since I was, like, since I knew about sex, that I was, I don't know, well, 13 or something, I've always never thought of it as sex. I've thought of it as making love to a man. I don't know why God made me with this idea you should always please your husband, I don't know, I don't know, but, um, it's making love to a man or ma him having making love to you, not sex. So I, I different that. Sex is just as they say in MTV guys are putting your P in a V when making love is you love each other so much that you're gonna let that man be inside you yeah I love each other so much that your love is gonna turn into something and just combine and and then and then you'll feel like Madonna like We should wait, because what's the point of having sex with any random loser who's only going to put his V in a V, his P in a V, and it's not, like, going to be romantic at all. He's just going to be like, oh, my God, have you ever seen this movie, um, what's it called? Oh, fuck, I wish I could remember things more. I don't know, but it's about this girl who, um, is in her number 20th of guys she slept with, or 19, something like that, and she gets to a number 20th, um, she won't be able to get married, something like that, but there's a, a scene when there's this, um, Sue, the one who, she lost her virginity, and it's like a super little nerd, and he's just, like, fucking her, but he's not even doing it all, he's like, ugh, ugh, and it's, like, so disgusting, you're like, ew, that's not how I want to lose my virginity, so that's what I was thinking the other day, um, about your virginity, it's cool to be a virgin, because then you can wait, I mean, if waited this long, you might as well wait for one who's actually worth it. I used to think um, about this before, like, I'm going to lose my virginity with someone I love when he knows he loves me, and he better have a six-pack. Why did I think this? Because if I'm going to feel pain, at least I'm going to be able to fill up all his abs. <laughs> yeah, because it's supposed to be painful. I don't know. When, I, when I'll do it, I'll tell you. I think I've already said that in the video, but I always say that. So, after that, when, when I matured, when I turned, like, 18, I think it was, it was like, wait a minute, I'm only supposed to love him, and if I love him, I will be turned on by him, and if he loves me, he will be turned on by me, instead of just thinking if I have big boobs or he has a six-pack. So, that's what you should do. Just wait to lose your virginity until you love someone. Now, that's the cool thing about being a virgin. You can, I mean, you waited this long, you can fucking wait until you really do feel love for someone. Or until you really do find a hot dude who, maybe he's just a hot tip for you even to think about the consequences. About that, ew, I just lose my virginity with a total stranger, but who cares? He was hot. I mean... At least find a hot guy or someone you love. Wait until you love that person. That's another consequence. Have you ever seen um, Secret Teen? I love that show. It's kind of stupid, but I love it. I mean, I love um, 
I love that show. I just really do. I love that show. I started seeing it from the first episode, and I haven't missed one since. And if I do miss one, I look it up in YouTube, and I find it before you publish it on Facebook and it's like YouTube took it away because um, of ABC family's shit and you don't want to share it. It's not our fucking problem and you had to go to a party and you didn't catch up with them. Yeah, they're bitch about that. But anywho, that's something you can happen. You could like have sex and get pregnant when you're a stupid little teen. At least if you have sex and you wait until you're like 19, like my age, which I'm still a virgin. But if you do it like through this age, at least your body will be ready. And at least your stupid boyfriend, who I hope you fucked your boyfriend instead of just a stupid little stranger, he will be like, okay, I'm in, I'm in college. I love you. I'm old enough to be a father, and that's what you want. A stupid father with you if you're fucking pregnant. Yeah. And if you're not, you should stay, like, a virgin. Now, if you're not going to stay a virgin, at least protect yourself. Because still, you don't want no babies or no disgusting diseases. You never know where that pee, who was the first bee of that pee. And maybe this bee is clean, but maybe that bee wasn't that clean because she's got a whole lot of peas in her bee. Yeah. I've seen too much on TV. I haven't, I, I want to see guy code. I like it because you figure out things about men. But, um. I think it's tomorrow or Wednesday. I don't know. So, that's what you should do. You should, or if you're going to lose your stupid virginity, you're going to have to protect yourself and not do it that often. That way it's special. It doesn't become sex and it still is making love with your boyfriend. And if you're not going to lose it and stay a virgin like me, then just wait for the right one. Wait for the right one until you feel, and I think I, I read that in a magazine. Uh, when you're gonna be in your days, I mean, in your days. <laughs> I just gonna finish my last video with this because see, I just did this like I finished that one. I started this, doing this one, and I did the one before. Yeah. Okay. So when you're like when you're, you're the boyfriend, and you are supposed to look in his eyes, and then you just feel that you're re ready for him to make love to you with no fear. Because if you're about to have sex and you suddenly feel fear, you're not supposed to do it. You're supposed to be completely turned on. And you should even tell him when you're going to say virginity, like, hey, go go slow on me. I'm a fucking virgin. Turn me on completely until I'm, okay, this is going to sound so gross, but until I'm completely wet. I'm sorry if you see my channel. Call it gross. If I'm completely wet, then... You may put your P in my V, because then it will hurt as much, because um, you're turned on. And I think they say that when you're turned on, if you're really turned on, it won't hurt, because you're just too turned on to even feel the pain, or your V just opened, something like that. But anywho, we virgins rule. And someday, when I'm not a virgin, I will make a video about me not being a virgin, and I will tell you that virgins don't rule and that unvirgins rule but the truth is we both rule why virgins rule because you're cool enough to save it for the right guy and unvirgins rule because they're women enough to make love to their hus husband to their boyfriends because they love each other so we just both we both rock okay so thank you for watching my stupid virgin video, stay a virgin or don't, or just fuck whoever you want, um, just don't get any, um, STDs, don't get SIDA, don't get any disgusting things, don't do the disgusting things like oral or do it, whatever, um, don't get pregnant or go ahead, you can be like Kardashian with her new super little Kanye West baby, whatever, <laughs> okay, just do what the hell you want, stay a virgin, do not stay a virgin, and let's sing some more Madonna. <laughs> oh. And make sure that when you lose your virginity, it feels like the stupid song, like, because you really love them. That's what Madonna wanted to give in this song. That's her message, yeah, because I decided it on the type of girl. Okay, bye. <laughs>